What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Funko 411. On today's episode of Rip and Randoms, I've got a couple of the Vampire Freddies. I was finally able to get my hands on those. It's been a little while, but I ended up buying a couple of them on the secondary market. So hopefully we'll get some chases. You never know with something like that. I also have a couple Remy, so I'm excited to see those in person. And then I got a bunch of other random ones that I'm also excited to open up. So let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, so who should we go ahead and kick this off with? Why don't we kick it off with Jay? Probably the lesser popular of the group here. So we'll see if we can pull a chase on the Jay. Uh, Silent Bob has started to pop up. I saw that guy showing up on Instagram. So I'm sure you'll see him in the coming days, weeks. But here is Jay. Let's see if we can pull a chase. Ready? One, two, three. Nope, it is just the common, common J. One in 7,100. We'll take a quick, quick look at him. There's J. That's pretty cool. I actually like that a lot. Not like the biggest J and Silent Bob fan, but I will keep, I'll keep a common. I like that they have his little uh, logo on the back of his jacket there. It's pretty neat. All right, who should we do next? How about we do Willy Wonka? I'm sorry if you guys can notice my voice is just a little bit off. I've been a little under the weather. Hopefully coming out on the other side of that now, but you can tell my voice is a little off, so my bad. Here's Willy Wonka. With this guy, we're looking for the chase that has Willy Wonka holding the golden ticket. This is my first time opening this on the channel, so let's see. Ready? One, two, and three. Hey, look out, it is Willy Wonka with the golden ticket, first one. Very nice. Take a look at that. Cool. That looks good. Willy Wonka, golden ticket. Obviously the common, common's gonna look like that with his cane no ticket so it's actually a good variation because you know this one he doesn't have the cane so the common's actually a pretty good differentiation but yeah there's Willy Wonka one chase we got one do our little little chase count over here hopefully this isn't the last chase pod we're putting down you know why don't we leave the figure out too I don't usually do that but we'll go ahead and leave the figure out put it like that all right let's do 11 11 um, pretty straightforward one. Either she's going to look like that or the chase is going to have the wig. So Stranger Things, they just dropped a new little, like a teaser trailer for. Looks pretty good. So here's 11. Ready? One and a two and three. No way! Two in a row. 11 with the wig. Man, that's funny because this is actually not the first... 11 that I've opened. I actually opened one of these a couple days ago, and I also pulled a chase. So luck is luck is on my side with 11. There she is, 11 with the wig. Cool. I'll go ahead and lay her there too. All right. Well, we are we're on fire so far. Two out of three. I hope I didn't just jinx it. Let's do underdog. Underdog. This might be the very first one that I'm opening. I did get maybe two of these guys and I saved, saved the other one for another video, so we'll see how we do. Underdog. Ready? One and a two and three. <laughs> no way! This is not real. Underdog with the shoe shine as the shoe shine boy. I'm like in shock. I cannot believe it. That is three chases. Wow. What the heck? I'm kind of disappointed that I don't have I don't even have the commons to show you guys. Let's see, there he is. Underdog. 
And then, yeah, obviously the... I, I mean, to be honest, I actually prefer the common on this one. Um, but there is the chase. All right, let's see if we can keep this luck going. I'm probably going to save these four for the end of the video. So let's go ahead and do Winnie the Pooh. And there goes Sorcerer Mickey. This is one of the uh, one of the issues of doing this on a desk is they always like to roll around. And for Winnie the Pooh, this is the very first one that I'm opening. I do have one of these that I got um, as like a trade with somebody, but I have never opened one before. So this is my first time opening a Winnie the Pooh. These sold out really quick on Hot Topic and I mean, there's 10,000 of them, so I'm, I'm not sure if they're gonna show up again on Hot Topic or not, but they were hard to get. So here's Winnie the Pooh, ready? One, two, and three. Nope, common Winnie the Pooh, but you know what? That's all right, we're doing, we're doing really good. There's Pooh eating out of the honey pot. That's a cool soda, I mean, Pretty much just classic poo. All right, since Sorcerer Mickey wanted to roll away, let's go ahead and open him. And with Mickey, we opened one of these a while ago. It was an international one before the, the domestic one started hitting. Um, the Chase is gonna have the pails of water in his hand and then the common will look like that. So let's see what we got for Mickey. All right, here we go, one. And a two, and three. <laughs> oh man, we are on a roll today. Sorcerer Apprentice Mickey with the buckets. Yeah, if you wanna go look at the, the common, I'll, I'll link the video now. So if you wanted to go back and look at it, it might have been like, it was one of the bigger soda videos, like either the 50 or the 150, I can't remember. There is the chase. Yeah, he's got the water buckets. They've got the translucent water in there. That's nice. That looks good. There you go. Sorcerer Apprentice Mickey. All right, let's do Yakko. Yakko, I got this guy because I, at some point, you know they're going to make the other two Animaniacs, so I want to at least get one of each. I probably won't be like going after the chase and the common. Probably be happy just keeping whatever one I get. So here we go, ready, and a one, and a two, three. And it is just a common, and that is totally fine. Let's take a look at Yakko real quick. And there he is. That's cool. Got his pants jacked up high. Did a little bit of like a, a lip on his pants, so it gives him a little bit of dimension. That looks good. Okay, let's do Master Chief and then we'll get into these four. I mean, I'm the most excited about the Vampire Freddies because I, it felt like we were waiting forever on those. And like I said, I did get those on uh, Mercari, so who knows? I. We'll talk about that more in a second, but for now, let's go ahead and do Master Chief. Ready? One, two, and three. It is just a common, common Master Chief. Take a little peek at him. They did a good job with this one. I mean, for like a Halo, you know, Halo fans out there, it's a cool little desk desk ornament kind of thing. It's cool to just put it on your desk, even if you're not a soda collector. This would be something that I would want if I was a big Halo fan. Um, So it's a cool little figure. I'm not a a big Halo fan, but I did want to check it out. So there it is, Master Chief. All right, let's do, I want to do the Remy's first and then we'll end it with the Vampire Freddy's. So Remy, um, these I think you'll start seeing pretty soon in the US, these are international, so I did pay a little extra for them just to get them early so that could open them on the channel, but by the time I post this video, you know, we might be seeing them in stores and stuff, so. Oh, a little tough on the lid there. Let's see. And for these, keep in mind, international, so we're looking for a white pog. One. Two and three. Ah, see, can't get fooled. That is a red pog. 
One in 8,400, so that's the common. And there is Remy. Oh yeah, that looks good. It definitely has like a very similar texture to the way they did the Rat Fink soda. So like, I mean, it's pretty much identical, obviously just a different character, but for all you Disney fans, all you Ratatouille fans, this is, this is one that you'll want to get. All right, let's try our luck on the second Remy. Let's see how we do. Hopefully it's a little easier to open than that first one and really like ripping my fingers apart. All right, a little easier. Maybe that's a good sign. Let's see. All right, here we go. One, two, and three. Oh, it is blocked Remy. Nice. Check that out. Woo, that's exciting. Look at that. I was not expecting that. Cool, yeah, he looks, I mean, it looks a lot different with the flop. So there he is. You can tell the texture is kind of actually diminished a little bit because it's kind of hidden beneath the flocking, but looks really good. There he is. All right, well, that's, that's another chase. That is another chase. That is unreal. What is that? That's five out of, how many did we do? I think we only did 12, is that right? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. Yeah, five out of 12 so far, and we haven't even opened these yet. All right, well, let's see how we do on these Vampire Freddy. So I'm gonna tell you what I was gonna tell you a little bit earlier, but what I, <laughs> I saw on several people, including Rock and Row, open um, ones like this, that had like these really loose wrappers and I watched people on Whatnot open them. So when I was searching on Mercari, I intentionally was looking for listings that had like these looser wrappers because I saw that people were pulling chases from them. So who knows if that's gonna actually turn out to be true or not, but I, you know, that's the best I could do at the time, trying to make, make my guess and, and try to pull one, so. Let's see what we get on our first Vampire Freddy. Ready? One, two, and three. Ah, nope. Theory goes out the window on the first one. First one is a common. But there he is. Wow. It's actually, that's... It's better than I expected. He, it's definitely more substantial, a much bigger figure than I expected too. And better than I expected is a good thing because I had pretty high expectations. So that looks, that looks really good. There is Vampire Freddy. All right, so here's our last chance. Our last chance, I do, I did buy some more. I'm not gonna lie, I bought, I bought probably like another five or six of these off of Mercari. So we'll, we'll definitely open more of these in the future, but we'll see about this one. This one looked very hopeful. It looked very similar to other ones I saw that were chases. So come on, let's see what we can do. Almost feels like a double pog. Let's see, ready? One and two and three. No, just the common again. Ah, man, yeah, he tricked me. He definitely tricked me on that wrapper. Cause it almost looked like a reseal. It was kind of crazy. It almost looked like it was a reseal, but it was just a really loose wrapper. But there he is, there's Vampire Freddy. But you know what? Even though we didn't hit that one, we do have more of these to open in future videos. I, we still, we crushed it today. Five out of 12. Doesn't get much better than that. We got the underdog. We got Remy. We got Sorcerer Apprentice Mickey. The 11 with wig. And we got Willy Wonka. This one, the Ratatouille is probably my favorite. The Remy is probably the best one. I mean, maybe it's because it's the one that I have seen the least of and because the flocking just looks so good, but that's my favorite. You guys let me know down in the comments which one of those was your favorite, or maybe it was one of these other ones. I mean, the, the common Vampire Freddy is awesome too, but I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. 
do all of that stuff and I will see you on the next one.